Um, and now welcome again to uh, the Circle X, the Green Trillion Club, to this episode with uh, Ambassador Noel Lynch. Uh, he's uh, the ambassador of the Barbados Islands uh, in the United States, based in uh, Washington, D.C. Uh, we are here uh, because Barbados is one of the main sponsors of Supercars Miami 2023 uh, to kick off the Formula One Grand Prix week uh, in beautiful Miami. Um, Barbados has partnered with Bentley um, that is also a brand uh, engaged in uh, becoming totally sustainable by 2025 and obviously Barbados campaign is within the framework of the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. So Ambassador, would you like to explain to our audience what is a business Barbados, Sustainable Barbados is about? Well, well first of all, um, Barbados is a small country. We like to describe ourselves as not just as a small island developing state, but as a big ocean developing state. The ocean around us is 400 times the land mass of size in terms of what we have. And we believe that the next frontier of development is within the oceans. Parallel to that must be the concept of sustainability and the SDGs of the United Nations. But Barbados is pioneering and Barbados is Prime Minister Mia Motley is pioneering the concept that we need to do more for climate change within the hemisphere. Um, we have underestimated the amount of, of resources that we need, financial resources and other resources, to make sure that climate finance really goes where it has gone. Because my development in a small island developing state or big ocean state affects bigger countries as well. If you don't believe in climate, you don't believe in climate change, you've just got to look at what has happened in the United States in the past month or so. Um, tornadoes that we couldn't even imagine, flooding in South Florida that had evacuations and the closing of the airport. What is fundamental must be that we speak of sustainability and not just sustainability for small islands, but sustainability for, the for small islands yes. impacts large developed states Absolutely. And for the entire planet. Absolutely. You may remember that uh, United Nations Secretary General Kofi Annan received the uh, Peace Nobel by the Nobel Academy and they mentioned the uh, concept of the butterfly effect which uh, postulates that if a butterfly um, shakes uh, uh, her wings in one place of the planet, a hurricane can generate in the opposite yeah. side of the globe. And so that is a reflection of the concept that everything is connected. We live in an ecosystem that yeah, everybody uh, is connected to. Climate is not just about climate change and the things that we think about in terms of mitigation and resilience against environmental issues. But climate is multidimensional. And therefore, climate change affects, for example, migration. It affects the issues of, of security, for example. And climate is about more than just, um, just one aspect of the, of the environment being affected. So you can have increased hurricanes, you can have increased forest fires in California or in South America. But what is important is this. People are moving to get away from climate change. That affects other people. But Barbados is, is into pioneering more than just as a tourism-led economy, which will always be a tourism-led economy. But more important is that we're open for business. We're exactly. open for business that pushes Barbados forward and helps other small states also to become global players in what must be a commitment to the SDRs. Now, now when we talk about resources, I mean, we're not even talking about what happened in COVID, for example, took away a lot of the resources that we would traditionally use for aspects of our development. So you, the monies that we would raise would go into health and education, you know, um, infrastructure, even digital transformation. But then when you think about what has happened in climate, climate and COVID has crowded out the other areas of our development, and we must get them back. And to be able to get them back, it must be about doing more business. It must be about opening all these countries to business from the developed world. Absolutely. And just to wrap up this uh, interesting uh, conversation, uh, Ambassador, 
um, uh, our company, Exan Technologies INC, that produces Circlex, the what we call the Green Trillion Club. Mm -hmm. And uh, the concept is that this is a new multi-trillion economy that uh, opens business opportunities in all industries, from motorsport to food, agriculture, uh, fashion, uh, and the real estate, hospitality, and so on. So we produce a mastermind uh, in association with uh, the uh, Climate Smart Zone, uh, that is uh, a, a platform uh, promoted by Sir Branson, Richard Branson from the Virgin Group and supported by the Inter-American Development Bank, by the World Bank and obviously um, uh, Barbados governments uh, as well as other Caribbean governments are highly engaged to create this new smart climate zone in which public-private partnerships are conducive to promote sustainability from energy to agriculture. So, Ambassador, thank you very much thank for you. uh, for your uh, uh time thank for you. your uh thinking. I'll uh, take uh, uh Bar business Barbados with me and uh, we are going to share it with the circle with the members of the Circle X, the Green Trillion Club. Thank you very thank, much. Thank you, thanks, sir. Thanks right. a lot.